Hi guys, welcome back. This is going to be a collective. Okay, we're going to see what the messages are. All right. If you haven't yet, be sure to go check out all signs, okay? I feel as though they were very informative this time around. Make sure to go follow me on my OnlyFans. The link will be in the description box as well as the comment section. And I will post it again on my community tab as well. Okay. So be sure to go follow me there. All right. I already have a video posted there. I'm going to be posting a lot there, putting in a lot of work. All right, we got the Seven of Wands, okay? So please, guys, if you didn't catch my live last night or you was not able to watch it, I have started an OnlyFans where I will be doing um, readings, but you'll just be seeing more of me. More like podcasts, talks, readings, just... um um expressing my creative side poetry we're gonna have we're, it's just a lot of videos about talk upliftment um dancing i like to dance and just being sexy and everything so y'all get to see a lot there of course nothing crazy okay of course not but um it definitely will be um a lot more channeling and all kinds of shit going on there that y'all haven't seen me do on youtube so make sure to go check that out okay the link will be in the description box, comment section, and on my community tab. So the Seven of Wands is giving me a, a no. Um, so this is a no. This is a rejection. So if you apply for something, this is a no. This is being rejected. Or this is a um, blocking somebody standing your ground, standing up for yourself. Or this could be a backfire. All right. Yeah, the Ace of Swords. Yeah, when I said backfire, that candle um, made that noise. So this could have something to do with something backfiring here. Because I did see the Magician when I was um, shuffling and I saw the High Priestess as well. So th that is, those are cards of like, it could be some kind of something going on here. Yeah. But I'm getting you already know. Yep, I see it again. Magician right here, High Priestess right here in, in Virgo. So it could be a Virgo. Aries, Pisces, or somebody like that. All right, I found a card in here that shouldn't be there. So we have wealthy man, which could be um, a significant and omen. So this wealthy man, um, things could be backfiring on here. All right, or this is you or something like that. All right, so let's see oh, what this is. I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. We got the six of wands and the justice. Wow and the ten of wands so i do feel like this is this is karma this is justice i feel like somebody's being brought to their knees all right somebody that's very successful somebody that is um very much in the public eye or high follow or somebody of high rank and a wealthy man it's right here Somebody could be a millionaire. I feel like somebody's losing a lot of money, their business and everything. And I feel like this is due to karma with the justice. The scales are being, yeah, the 10 of swords and I saw the 10 of wands. And in both cards, this person is on his knees being brought down. So I don't know if this is somebody that has been um, on some fuck shit here or this is you. It's coming back around heavy. It's been a lot of seven of wands is coming out, which is like a lot of backfires, man. Whatever has been going on is, uh, what, what's the seven of wands? Oh, Lord, what's the seven of wands? God, I told you, God. We have the magician here falling out in the reverse. What's this one? Yep, we got the magician in the reverse and this king of wands in the reverse. So whoever this wealthy man is, that's an omen that card was in this deck. I need to go through my decks and make sure other cards ain't in other decks because I've been finding that a lot lately. But anyways, whoever this um whoever this wealthy person is or whatever the fuck this is going on is giving me no. Okay. Um, the King of Wands in reverse can be somebody that's very much a tyrant, somebody that is very much, um, it's like my way or the highway, very evil, hateful, somebody that, um, somebody that you just don't give a fuck. 
Okay, I feel like with the magician here, oh, this was already, I feel like with the magician here, something is uh, really backfiring on somebody here. Okay, somebody's being brought to their knees or brought out of their ego or, or something is being brought down here majorly. We have the full card. And I want to clarify what that is, okay? Because I feel like somebody's very arrogant, very prideful. The King of Wands in reverse can also... Uh, be somebody that could be very abusive as well, physically, because wands are physical. All right, so this could be somebody that's abusive, very, um, very abusive physically, somebody that could be very narcissistic, somebody that wants control and power by any means. They're willing to do whatever to get it, okay? Um, period. They're willing to do whatever to get it. And, and I feel like that or somebody has been doing this ongoing for a long time and it's coming back on their ass. Okay, heavy. All right, that's kind of what I'm getting here. I just feel like this could be somebody very angry too, very agitated, somebody that will go off on your ass in a heartbeat. So this could be due to this loss of money, this wealthy man, someone's going through a, a legal situation, justice, they're facing it really, really bad. It's backfiring really, really bad and it's affecting somebody. I feel like somebody's mental state, even though I see nothing about the mental here, I feel like somebody's mental state is being affected here too. I'm just hearing that. Um... I just feel like somebody's a poor leader. They're, this is somebody that abuses their position that um, people do not respect because somebody leads with emotion and anger and wanting to win to the point where they're losing majorly. The seven of wands is the strongest energy. It came out first. So something is backfiring. I feel like somebody, somebody, they, they try to drive their point home. They want to win so, so bad to the point that this person is like losing major credibility to motherfuckers because it's just, it's, it's it's almost as if people are asking why what are you what are you doing or this is you okay I just feel like somebody feels alone. This is the type of energy where you, where this type of person pushes people away. People do not want to be around this person at all because they're always doing something wicked i'm sorry I'm, I'm waiting for this message to come in but anyways they're always doing something wicked as fuck okay this is this this king of wands in reverse is really giving me a bad energy this could even be somebody that has some kind of sexually transmitted disease here as well could be an aries with this magician it could be a, um a gemini or uh, or i'm feeling like a leo uh energy here but it could be any sign. It could be any sign. Literally, Aquarius. I just keep focusing on this King of Wands as if it's more I need to say about it. I just feel like somebody's very egotistical. It could be a Leo. I just feel like somebody blames the world for it, for everything that's happening to them, or they're blaming you, or you, or this is you, or they're blaming everybody else around them for these misfortunes and this backfire that's happening. But this is somebody that's a bully. They're abusive mentally, physically, spiritually. Definitely could be physically, very violent. This is somebody that's outraged. I feel like somebody's losing their fucking mind. I, I don't know, but I'm just getting somebody who is losing their fucking mind. Something here, yeah, and the magician in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like it's a Virgo because this person on this card looks like a Virgo. But it could be a Leo or it could be any damn body. An Aquarius. Somebody doesn't want to take responsibility. It's everybody else's fault but theirs. So this is you. This is somebody who lacks a lot of integrity, man. A cheater as well. A liar, a cheater, a con. Somebody that lacks integrity. They're not respected. People see this person for who they are. Yeah, okay. 
Somebody could uh, possibly drink here very heavy. I don't know where that's coming from. I don't see no cups, but I'm getting like somebody that's drinking a lot. I see somebody at the bar or maybe they're at home. They just drink a lot. It's almost like they're trying to drown something out here. Oh, yeah, I do see. That is the drinking. See, three of cups. I just noticed this was in this deck. Literally, I just noticed that. Yeah, so somebody drinks, they cheat, they lie, they have third parties. Somebody just lacks integrity, integrity period. It's a Leo or a Sagittarius or Aries, Virgo or somebody. Very promiscuous energy here. Will sleep with anybody? Okay. What's this King of Wands in reverse with the Seven of Wands? What is it? What what is this energy? Okay, yeah, we have this King of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, somebody here is emotionally unstable and they're drinking heavy. That's what the King of Cups is is in the reverse. I almost feel like somebody could damn near be a fucking pervert too, into children and, and, and or or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, this is. I, I what's the King of Wands reverse and the Magician in the reverse? King of Wands in the reverse and the Magician in the reverse. Yep, the Tower. There it is. Could be a Scorpio. And the strength card, yep. Could be a Leo. Could be an Aries. A Scorpio Gemini energy here. It could be any damn body. All right. Or somebody with those placements, sun, moon, or rising, or whatever the fuck this is. Okay. But I'm definitely getting an energy here where um something is backfiring bad. And it's the black magic. I feel like somebody's magic don't even work. It don't work on you. The universe, the tower is here to say, it's, I'm coming in to shake this motherfucking shit up. I feel like somebody is under a lot of pressure. Pressure. This could be a federal building, a government institution, an entity. Something is crashing. It's going to fall to the ground, burn. Because I feel like there's a lot of dark shit that has been going on in, in, in this corporation, entity, or whatever this is. A lot of dark, heavy shit has been going on here. And it's been hidden behind the fucking scenes. And now it's coming out. I just feel like real bad karma. And when I saw that justice show up in here, yeah. I feel like with this tower here, yeah, something is being... The tower is like whatever's hitting in this dark tower is being struck by lightning and it's falling. It's coming down. Whatever, whatever was being hidden here, it is going to be coming out or coming down or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, Sagittarius. What is the tower? Yeah, the temperance of Sagittarius. What is the um what is the tower card? I just feel like I just feel like it's yeah the the, the uh, palace of coins. So this could be a home situation. This could be literally somebody's home burning down or this building or something. Something is coming down here. There's gonna be some kind of obstruction to something here. Let's let me clarify a little bit with this one. What is this? Yeah, someone's like Page of Swords, Seven of Cups. So somebody could be watching you or listening to you or they're wondering, how do you know this? Yeah, the Page of Pentacles and the Justice or something about a lawyer, a legal situation, a Libran that has a lawyer in a legal situation or a, a, a lawsuit. Something is not going to turn out well. Let's see what this is. What's the tower with this uh, Palace of Coins? All right, because all of a sudden, or or someone's angry. I, I just feel like somebody's very, very upset and angry because their magic is backfiring. It's not working on you. The, oh, okay, yeah, the Empress. Oh, and the Eight of Wands. So something, okay, what's the Seven of Wands? Again, we have the Tower and the High Priestess. So something is backfiring. It's a Scorpio or it's a or it's something, but you know what somebody is doing. You're aware of what's going on. What's the tower and the seven of wands? It's here twice. It's the tower, tower, and the seven of wands. It's a no-go. Yeah, I just feel like, yeah, and the magician again. Two of swords and the magician. I, I just feel like it's almost giving me like something is pointless. It's not working, but yet somebody is determined to do something here. The emperor, this is an Aries, a boss, an entity, an institution, a corporation, or whatever this is. This is, or, or your father, your husband, or whoever is different for everybody. I feel like something's going to, something is, is going down bad. I don't give a fuck how somebody's putting it on a front. It's not, it's not like that. Somebody is suffering here. Yeah, the four of cups, and that was that two of swords. Something is not working at all, and that's irritating somebody to the core. 
Because I, I don't, yeah, God, y'all saw that? The magician fell out in the reverse perfectly again. This, this, this is giving me, yeah, the tool. This is giving me a major fucking backfire on somebody's ass. I'm also getting, I'm also getting, uh, yeah, but the, the magician in reverse can be manipulation and lies and opportunist or whatever um, the fuck this is going on. All right, I'm sorry. Let me just put this in. All right, yeah, I just wanted to. Okay, make sure I. All right, anyways, um, you're gonna get a confirmation or like of, of something here. You're gonna get a confirmation of a tower or something that's happening to somebody. Something is just not going well at all. Yeah, because I'm getting like, you're the empress, you're beautiful, you're progressive, or you're, or, or something like that. What, what, give, okay. The emperor and the, um, and the eight of pentacles and the king of pentacles, or someone's mad because you're working with this Aries, this Libra, or you're doing something or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, we got the two of swords and the, and the page of swords, seven of cups. Yeah, someone's like, uh, Okay. Okay, this magician here in the reverse like this is is giving me. Uh, let me let me just see what I'm picking up from this. Besides manipulation, lies, somebody black magic isn't working on you. It's backfiring and all that shit. We got the tower here it's twice. Something is crashing and burning and falling, and that's real shit. Yeah, that's confirmation when that when that car revved up like that. Cause the magician in reverse is like false promises, a con man, a liar, somebody that I don't know, just just, just I don't know. But the King of Wands right there, I keep looking back at that. I just feel like somebody is like, they're unreliable. They're a loser. They're a liar. People do not trust this person. People could be, be walking away. I just feel like something is just de completely deteriorating for somebody. Or this is you. This could be a marriage, an entity, a corporation, an entity, wh whatever the fuck this is. All right? I feel like somebody's a thief, a con man, a liar, and it's all being revealed. Somebody, yeah, somebody's a con man, and and they and they and it's, it's it's almost like somebody wants you. I don't know what somebody. Yes, it's almost like somebody's trying to delay something, slow something down, keep you from doing something. But I, but I feel like it's backfiring on their ass. You have the death card and the ten of swords. Something's gonna come. Whatever this celebrating, laughing, or whatever this is, somebody's doing behind the scenes. That's just gonna come to a dead end. Period. This four of wands, seven of wands is here again. I'm also getting your home is protected. What's this right here with the Empress and the Eight of Wands? What's this with the Empress and the Eight of Wands? I just wanted to clarify that. Let's see. Let's get some more cards out. Yeah, because you see how the Five of Wands is? It's like somebody continuously is raging war on this Empress or attacking them and doing shit like that. But the tables are going to turn on you with the Wheel of Fortune real, real bad. What's the Empress and the Eight of Wands? Because I, 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 I don't understand why someone's doing this. Yeah, the Ace of Swords, possibly because you're 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 doing something new or something is progressing or you got money or you're comfortable or you live like this. Yeah, somebody's trying to see you in the Five of Pentacles. Somebody wants to, yeah, the Queen of Swords and the Nine of Swords, but they're haunted by what they're doing. What's the Empress in the Eight of Wands with the Ace of Swords? The Star, yep. And the High Priestess, somebody... God, I'm so tired of this. Yeah, the lovers in the Ace of Cups. You have new love coming in, Palace of Cups, or you have a lot of love. You get an overwhelming response. People love you, or they love what you're doing, or something is growing. Here, it's really taking off. 
I feel like somebody, somebody is determined to do something to you. They're determined to the point where they are suffering. They're ill. They're sick. There, there is backfiring. They're losing everything. What is this over here? Why is the magician coming out twice with the seven of cups, the tower here twice, the four of cups, two of swords? What is this? Yeah, I feel like somebody is literally sick here or on bed rest or sick. They can't get up. They're weak or something. Something real bad is happening here. I feel like somebody, they do this work on you and, they, and then they're confused because you're still inspirational. You're still progressive. You're still winning. You're still stronger. I don't know why somebody, I, I don't know, man. Yeah, the Eight of Cups. The Lovers in the Judgment, Gemini Energy. So really somebody's in, uh, okay. Tell me more about, yeah. So someone wants to apologize or give you something. It could be a Gemini. They want to reconcile with you. They could be reaching out to you. There could be some money coming in here by surprise as well. This could take you by surprise, this money, or the or you getting this home, or whatever this is. Or or maybe you may be um, shocked at how fast something takes off. What is this over here? Four cups and the two of swords. And I feel like it's a bunch of bullshit going on here. We got this king of cups in the reverse. Somebody is drinking heavy. They're losing their fucking mind. They're sick. Somebody's not doing well. And they're stalking you. Palace of swords. Or something about views. I just feel like somebody's stressed out. They're crying. They're sad. They're sick. They don't know what to do. Because something heavy is coming back on their ass. Okay? It's, it's affecting them. And I'm getting real heavy here too. All right, yeah, what is this? Why is this king? That's why you don't do shit like this. What's the seven of wands tower here? Tell me more, yeah, the nine of swords. This shit is haunting somebody. Somebody is being haunted here. They can't sleep or they're hearing noises in the night or they just feeling like, you know, um, somebody may be delusional. I feel like somebody's mental health is being affected. Somebody can't really remember their days or remember anything. Somebody like this is really, really you're going to get a confirmation. You may you may notice how somebody's like kind of delirious or they're sick or they just everything is falling apart. This is because of the wicked they keep trying to send you or that they sent you. This is due to the wicked. Just period. Yeah, and they're stalking and watching you. There's a page of swords heavily. Somebody is stalking you. I would yeah, so it could be a Virgo with the hermit card. I'd be very careful and watch your fucking back. Because I feel like somebody, um, let me let me see what this is, man. What's the nine of swords over here? Cause cause somebody here, yeah, the six of swords. Someone's worried about you moving on or moving forward, or because you did move forward, or you moved on, or you're looking towards the future, or you turned your back, or whatever the fuck. Yeah, the full card, you're done. You've moved the fuck on. Just, yeah, and this could be in work, Eight of Pentacles. Are you relocated for work or whatever this is, man? Who is this person right here with this King of Cups reverse and this Nine of Swords? Yeah, the Moon card in the reverse. Somebody that is suffering mentally. Someone's also fearful. They feel haunted. Something, something. What's the Seven of Wands tower? Yeah, the Nine of Wands in the reverse. Really somebody, yeah, the Devil in the Eight of Swords. Really somebody, somebody, it, it, they're trying to keep you in a the loop. They keep trying to do something to you here. Three of Wands, Five of Pentacles. This person is trying to put you, or they want you to um, be homeless. This person is going to be, someone's losing everything. What is this right here, man? What is this uh, moon in the reverse with the Eight of Swords and the Devil? Nine of Wands in reverse. Somebody's being told to give up, stop doing this. Somebody feels tired, weak, but they keep trying to sabotage or have you stuck. What is this moon? It's a Cancer or a Capricorn, an Aries, your boss, a C, a CEO, a husband, or something like that. What is this? What is yeah? It's like somebody wants to keep you in a constant state of tears, crying, loss, or lack. It's just not gonna happen like that. What's the Eight of Swords and the Devil, man? Because this, this is starting to get on my fucking nerves. It's just, it's the same shit, dog. Yeah, the Four of Cups, it's just not working. Somebody's so focused on destroying you to the point where they're sick as fuck. And you're still over here beautiful, growing, progressive, doing your thing. Yeah, the Four of Wands, attractive, successful. You're a performer or you're on stage or whatever this is. Something is still good for you because it's your destiny. Yeah, you're growing fast too with the Eight of Wands. Real fast. It's your fucking destiny. Somebody keeps trying to take away your birth fucking right. Okay? Or something that is, is yeah, the five of somebody keeps, yeah, it's, to, it's turning back on somebody. The will of fortune and the five of wands. 
Somebody keeps raging, warning you, keeps doing this, and you keep finding a way to turn the tables back on their ass. Somebody cannot handle it. What is this sick shit going on? What's happening over here? Somebody cannot handle it. Yeah, they cannot handle. Yeah, the strength card, Leo energy. You could be very strong, very powerful, a warrior. Yeah, the palace of swords. I'm getting something about views or, yeah, the five of swords. Yeah, you're making good choices. Your views are up or somebody, look at how this five of swords looking. Somebody is just upset. They're angry. I wish somebody would get the fuck off your dick, man, and move on with your sick ass life. You sick fuck, mentally, physically, spiritually. That's why you're losing your business, your money and everything. You're going down the drain, bitch. And it looks like some, some real heavy shit is going to happen here. What is the four of swords right there? Because it's giving me, yeah, I, and then I look over and I see the death. I'm telling you, man, something is not a fucking joke. What is the four of swords? And somebody knows that they're suffering and they still trying you, dog. We got the eight of pentacles. I feel like somebody's trying to make you too tired to work or to do something. Someone's trying to make you delusional or they're trying to they're trying to dead the ideas you have within you. They don't want to see you progress. They want to see you lazy. Don't work. Trying to make you tired. Somebody just keeps doing this. And I feel like it's taking them out. God, do something. Like, I'm serious. Like, why the what the fuck is this? Somebody needs to be taken the fuck out completely. Dead it literally. Because this, this shit is not going to stop. Somebody is not going to stop coming for you or you're not going to. Yeah, the death, as I said that. And that's going to be the, the result of this. It has to be because somebody will not stop. Something catastrophic. Either this person is going to um, die or somebody very close to them or several people. This person has to learn, dog. And that's the way, yeah, the will of fortune. The tables are going to turn real, 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 real bad. Somebody just will not yield and, and, and move the fuck on. They will not bow. But with the nine of wands in the reverse, you will. We have you pulling the star again. Because you're a star, a huge one. Someone's going to be a huge star or you are one. You have the ace of wands or you're creating something. You're doing something new. You're progressing. You're changing. Somebody doesn't want to see that. You have the ten of swords and the three of cups. Four of swords. This nine of wands in reverse, it's like somebody's fighting for you to give up, bend, yield, bend to my will, bend, motherfucker, bend. It's just not going to happen like that. They, they want to see you down and out and broken. That's not your destiny. It's not going to happen like that ever. Somebody wants to see you bend to them or beg or not. You see them as a, as, as, as a pussy, a weak link, and you know what their fate is, bitch. And all you're doing is waiting on it. Somebody think they coming for you and you're going to bend the shit. No, bitch, you're going you're gonna to be the one that bends. You're going to be the one broken down to God. You are already going through it. Losing your shit literally is crumbling. Somebody's shit is crumbling. I don't give a fuck how it look. Somebody's shit is crumbling. Yeah, we got the strength card and the death card and the death card and the ten of swords. Somebody wants to put a complete end to your strength, to, your, to, to who you are. Yeah, nine of wands in reverse, eight of swords and the devil. Somebody wants, somebody wants to trap you, literally. Have you in the dark, hidden. Somebody wants to keep you from shining and moving. It's a Scorpio. Or it's a Aries. Somebody, somebody's trying to dead the confidence in you, the strength in you, and everything. Somebody wants to take you clean the fuck out. But we got the seven of wands here. Um, twice. It's just not going to happen like that. It's just it's not going to happen that way. No matter what. I, oh, no, we got the, the magician here twice, not the seven of wands. The magician here twice. The tower is here twice. The will of fortune is here twice. I'm surprised that justice hasn't come out the way these cards are looking. Yeah, the eight of cups and the ace of pentacles and the ace of cups. You moved on to new opportunities. Somebody wants you to know, you don't, you, you don't, you don't, I don't know what the fuck this is. All right, let's see. Yeah, this emperor, this could be a boss, like I said, your husband or whoever this is. Seven of Pentacles, Knight of Wands, or Sagittarius. Somebody has been doing this on you forever. Someone's projecting on you heavy or trying to do something. It's not working. You're like, man, I don't even see you, bitch. Like, what? who are you? Like, literally, yeah, the Seven of Swords, King of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, Six of Cups, Nine of Cups. Be careful of somebody trying to come back in here. This liar or opportunist from the past. Somebody trying to use you or do whatever because you're comfortable. What's the Empress that Palace of Coins and the Star? 
Well, what is this star here twice for? Yeah, yeah, the nine of wands. Someone cannot stand it. The world card is over. The seven of cups and the devil. Somebody wants you in this chain. You see, in this fucking cage. Cage down. I feel like you should be happy because you have a lot of opportunities. If you took a risk on an idea or something that you've been wanting to do here for quite some time, that was a really, really good idea and, a, and, and good job for you doing what you want to do because you're really going to be able to express your creativity here. I do see a reconnection with the Gemini. You or you could be reconciling or healing something with this person. Somebody could be calling or reaching out to you, but I do see major growth here with the Six of Wands and the Eight of Wands. A lot of growth. Yeah, the Palace of Swords. This is views. So views or um, patron. Yeah, the, the Palace of Wands. A lot of views, a lot of support, a lot of money because we have Palace. So this is a lot of people fucking with you. Yeah, you can look forward to this. What is this? All oh, this Palace of Swords, Eight of Wands, Six of Wands. Because I'm getting like support. I'm getting like a lot of support here. I'm seeing the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, the Eight of Swords and the Death. Somebody's trying to dead that, sabotage that, put it into it, it the best they can. And it just keeps back. It's a Virgo. It just keeps backfiring. This fucking Virgo and your family or your mother just will not leave you the fuck alone. They've done everything all your fucking life to try to destroy you and, and keep you down and hinder you, bitch. And they will not let the fuck up. So get ready for your fate, you old, wicked, miserable bitch. Or this corporation entity, I told you I saw the Six of Pentacles. You're gonna, you're being patronized here, or or whatever the fuck this is, or this ent entity, institution, corporation, or whatever the fuck this is. Yeah, I'm getting a new yeah, the Nine of Pentacles, a new opportunity here. You may be working with others. Somebody's just up. Uh, yeah, now we got the Palace of Cups. So a lot of love, a lot of views, a lot of growth, a lot of money, a lot of support. And a lot of attraction with the Palace of Wands here. I feel like somebody's trying to drain your energy or keep you from moving forward and try to make you too tired to do something where you don't get out of bed, you won't work, you won't do anything. Yeah, the Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. I mean, in the upright. I don't know why I want to say in the reverse. Probably because somebody wants to put you in the reverse. Somebody, yeah, the Four of Pentacles. Somebody wants to see you down and out or whatever this is. Yeah, the Four of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. Yeah, the Ten of Wands. Somebody keeps trying to put the Ten of Wands on this Empress energy. The Empress already came out. The Empress not going to live like that, bitch. The Empress is going to... And you got the Eight of Wands twice. She's going to live in the lap of luxury. She's going to be spoiled, f favored, and covered, bitch. And she's going to live her best life. And she's going to it live it even better than you could ever imagine, bitch. And the universe is going to rid this Empress of your fucking energy. Watch. I don't say nothing. I don't know, bitch. I know the universe is going to rid you. Whoever you are, yeah, judgment in the seven of wands. Whoever you are, you're going to be rid of this motherfucker. The universe is tired of them. They're going to deal with them because they just will not let the fuck up. What's the um, ten of pentacles? You got the six of pentacles here twice. So you are being patronized. Yeah, the king. So this could be an air sign in your family yeah, that wants to make up with you possibly. This could be like a um, brother or a cousin with the king. It could be a Libran or an Aquarius. Okay. But I'm getting with the judgment. Yeah. With the judgment and the seven of wands, Archangel Michael, Gabriel here, something is backfiring. The universe is stepping in now. They have to. I'm hearing an annihilating the enemy or the enemies. Yeah. The emperor and the two of cups and the king of cups and the nine of cups. Somebody wants to give you what, what is this here? 10 of pentacles and the um, king of swords. You're going to, you're going to be, yeah, the ace of swords. There's a new idea. The four of wands is comfortable. You're going to be completely ha happy and comfortable here. Yeah, the five of cups, knight of cups. Someone misses you. They want to apologize. It could be a Leo or a Sagittarius from your past or somebody you shared um, intimate times with, with the lovers or whatever this is. So there could be some healing that's taking place with this person. You love them. They love you too or whatever the fuck. Because lovers is, that's a very deep soulmate connection. It's a major arcana. All right. Or something like that. Or somebody could be pregnant or something like that. Let me, let me get.
I feel like there's a fire sign that's very passionate about you or you are. This will result in a definite de demise. You guys, that's why I tell you, when I say stuff, don't ever think I'm just saying because, oh, you're mad at the moment or you're this. Trust. I don't have these kind of gifts for nothing. When I say there's going to be a fucking um, a death as a result, that happens when you keep coming for somebody you just will not stop. The universe well, they're not going to play with you, man. Divinely protected. Our angel, Michael, didn't I just say that? This is him. When these two cards come out, if you look, look at him. Blowing the horn. This is Gabriel. Look at here. This is Gabriel. Protecting you. Something told me to put Gabriel here in this video. Okay? Divinely protected. Our angel, Michael, ancestors, guides, angels, and God. And then I seen, yeah, chosen, handpicked by the heavens. You are chosen here. Okay? Just period. If somebody hired a private investigator, they ain't even, they don't even want to do it no more. I hate your fucking guts because you don't want me. So somebody's mad because you do not want them. Yeah, I manifest the illness within myself by attack, by constantly hating and attacking you. God, somebody is sick. I told you, I feel like somebody is sick. Like literally, yeah, mentally disturbed and psycho. Somebody here, I'm telling you, somebody here is, they're suffering mentally. I would be, I'm telling you. Yeah, demonic and satanic. This is somebody that enjoys. They want to see you cry down, broken, everything. I know that I am poverty stricken in this life and damn to hell. Somebody knows they're going to hell and they're going to burn. They don't have a seat in heaven, period. They just don't. God clearly just told me that. My higher ups clearly told me that. And someone's losing their whole business, corporation, everything. We saw that in the live last night with the emperor reverse, king of pentacles reverse, the tower there. It's just over, man. You cannot fuck with the divine and think it's a game. Like you win it or God, like it's a fucking game. It's not a game, my nigga. I don't believe in karma. I am God and the devil. Okay, we'll see about that. I project failure and security on you every day. I'm telling you, someone's projecting on you, trying to make you tired. Don't do that. Don't go after that. Nobody cares or I, I, I don't know. Yeah, I will go to any extent of low to win. And you keep losing. Somebody's doing beauty spells on you too. Someone's trying to make your divine is fed up. Coming into a lot. God damn it, I just said it. I already said that. The divine is fed up. They're coming in to annihilate the enemies that you have or this enemy or enemies. And in, in the first card out is the strongest. This will result in a death demise, period. Something tragic has to happen to this person, to them or somebody they love dear in order for this person to stop. This person is so mentally disturbed. I'm not even sure they would stop even then. So then the universe is going to take it up. That other notch, that notch that just deads it, period. If they don't dead this person and they choose to, to dead someone around them, if that don't work and they keep coming, they're going to dead them off. I know it sounds harsh me saying this, but I'm, I'm not here to sugarcoat. I'm telling you what my guys are telling me. They show me confirmation. It's not a joke or a fucking game. I spread lies about you to constantly ruin your re reputation is in the reverse. That's not working. Your reputation is safe and safe. People know you as the emperor or the empress or the or whatever the fuck. They know what's up. We got filing police reports on you to set you up. So they're trying to set you up. Yeah, suffering from a fatal illness. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. It's just non-fucking-stop. It's just non-stop, man. You're too much competition. I have to completely destroy you. Somebody hates that you're winning, that you're in a position that you are in, but you were choked. Chosen. The judgment is being, that's your calling. Hacking into your accounts, emails, Instagrams, and bank account. Somebody has nothing to do, better to do with their pathetic fucking life. I'm obsessed with you and watch your home. Someone's watching you or driving past your house. I made a deal with the devil. Okay, well, it's, it's time to pay up, ho. I will conquer you and break you by any means. Somebody is sick, man. I lost my house, car, and uh, business corporation job. I'm working on you losing yours. I'm telling you, someone's losing their shit. If I can't have you, no one will. Yeah, because you don't want them. So they're doing they're doing all kinds of weird shit, breakup sales, blocking spells, trying to fuck with your money, trying to hinder you, make you tired and exhausted so you don't go after your dreams or project failure. That's going to fail. No, bitch, your mama failed when she ain't abort your motherfucking ass. That's what failed, ho. That's the bitch who failed, ho. So those are your, your motherfucking messages. I'm done. Okay. 
Um, I hope it just helped y'all stay 10 toes down, protect yourself. All right, yeah, someone could be apologizing to you from the past coming to your home. They wanna date you, they're sorry, or they or something about healing sex or whatever the fuck this is, okay? Or somebody loves you or they're sorry or whatever. I'm getting there's gonna be a reconciliation or healing or something's gonna be healed here, all right? Or two people are gonna be making love. I see two people making love here. And it's definitely making love with the lovers. It's not just sex, it's making love. Something is like kudalini sex. It's like deep. All right, so those are your messages. 4040, I love y'all. And I'm gonna see y'all in the next one. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, and follow. And follow your girl on her OnlyFans. Okay, I will have the link in the description box as well as my community tab and in the description box. Bye. In the comment section.